Hey everyone, Andrea from Spreadsheetables and today I'm going to show you how to uh, get all Wednesdays, for example, out of a date range. So let's start over here. I'm going to enter uh, date and first I'm going to format this whole entire column as um, a date. So I'm just going to format number um, and then go to date. So now I have July, and then I want the whole entire month of July. So I'm just going to drag this down, and this is going to give me all the days in the month of July. Now, I want to know, I don't have, a, this is not a calendar, so I don't know what day of the week this falls on, right? So what I'm, I, and I want to know um, all of the Fridays, for example, for in that date range. So all you're gonna do, you're gonna use two functions. You're gonna use the filter. Sorry, give me one second. So you're going to use the filter, and then you're going to select the range that you want to, you know, filter the data from. So you're gonna select this, and then you enter a comma. Uh, if you have a, a really long set of data in column A, you don't have to put a range, you can just do A because that way you will read the entire column. Um, and then you're going to use a function called weekday. And then you're also going to select the range that you want to get the weekday from. So we're going to do again A, right, from column A. And then you're gonna close this and you're gonna put equal. Uh, so Friday would be six, and then you close this. So now it gave me all of the Fridays of the month of July. And if you open the calendar, today is a Friday, Friday the 14th, and here it says Friday. So 7, 14, 21, 28, 7, 14, 21, and 28. And uh, if you want to do another weekday, you can just change here. So 1, uh, this will be Mondays, and Monday or Sunday. All right, so 1 is Sunday. So if you want to do Mondays, that's gonna be two. Now you can compare to the calendar and now you have three, 10, 17, 24, 31. Hope this video was helpful and I'll talk to you soon.